Well, I tell you who is speaking, uh, Bernie, and he is revving up those delegates. Uh, this, of course, as protests, his protesters against Hillary, they're revving up also. I want to go to Reverend Bill Owens, who is uh, leading one of those protests. Reverend, uh, I I'm sure that uh, there's no doubt that the Bernie Sanders folks uh, have a lot of legitimate uh, animosity toward Hillary and the Democratic Party, but is it so bad that they're willing to sink the entire ship? I'm not familiar with that. As a matter of fact, on many things, I disagree with Bernie. He's talking about free stuff, getting free, free, free. There is no free lunch. There is nothing free. You, you give up, you get something, you get a food stamp, you get something, but you give up your rights, you give up your, your dignity and your class and your desire to become somebody. So I don't agree with Bernie. Well, then, then let me, then, then here's the thing uh, on that particular topic. Why has the Obama administration made things like getting food stamps uh, so palatable? How come he's promoted it so much and they made it into a credit card and, hey, it's your right to get one of these things as an American? The, the Democrats have gone down that path. I, I could not have disagreed with uh, uh, President Obama more on that issue. You see, I was in the civil rights movement. I know what it means to work. I, at my age, I work 15 hours a day, six days a week. I believe in work, and when you program people to believe that they can get something for nothing, you fail. It's a failed system, and it was put in place by President Lyndon Johnson when he sent 100,000 social workers throughout the United States to talk to black women to get food stamps, get welfare, but the father had to be out of the home, and we're reaping the whirlwind now. Look at our young men. Look at our young women who were not father and mother per, uh, properly. And so I'm against it all the way. I don't care who it is, whether it be Hillary, uh, uh, Sanders, uh, Obama, it, it, it is wrong, and it was wrong. Well, I, I don't disagree with you on that. I, in fact, uh, I know that the, the, the legacy of it... Uh, as recent as, as until, ironically enough, until Bill Clinton, to a certain degree, was forced back toward the middle, and he had to do the sort of work to, pay, you know, the play work to, to give food stamps sort of program. All that's been erased since then. So, what do you make of the, uh, uh, the Democratic National Convention? The lineup has been set. We know it's all going to be about social justice and, and a continuation of rewriting the wrongs of yesteryear. A lot of people say that's a huge mistake. We should be focused on the future and how to sort of uplift all all the people in this country. I agree about justice, and that is my main message today. We want justice in America for everybody. We want justice for the, to, for the policemen of our country who do such a good job. But we also want justice for those policemen who abuse their power, their, who abuse their position and kill innocent people. We want justice for everybody. We want justice for our children to grow up and get a good education in America. Right. And it can happen. Right. It Re can happen. Reverend Owens, thank you very much. Really appreciate it. Thank you.